everyone, welcome to my Project Ideas channel. Today we'll learn how to automate your browser in Python with Selenium. So let us begin. So for this, first of all, we need you need to install the Chrome driver using this site. It is Chrome Driver .org downloads. After this, you need to install Python. Uh, for it, use the official website that is python.org in download section. You can simply download the Python from the from here. After this, you need to install Selenium. So for it, open the command prompt and type pip install. Selenium. Pip install Selenium. Uh, as I have already installed it, it is showing requirement already satisfied. Now after this, uh, setting the path of the Python, you have to simply type py in your command prompt and Python will be accessible from here itself. Now let us see our code. So this is our overall code. Over here, first of all, we need to import some modules. First one is the Selenium. It is used for the automation of the uh, browser, I mean web pages and all. In this, we have imported this web driver, and after it, uh, we are using this PIL and we are importing the image as well. Because at last over here, I will show you that how you can take the screenshot as well. So next, this is the browser. This is the element that I have uh, used as a variable of the web uh, of this uh, web driver. And over here, what we are doing is we are assigning the path location of the Chrome driver to a variable and this is the browser now uh, in this c drive i have saved this uh, chrome driver.exe file and you have to change the location as per your file path after it uh, i'm performing to maximize the browser this will open the browser after uh, using this maximize window function we can maximize the browser and one more thing over here, we are using this, we are doing this in Chrome. You can choose the browser of your choice as well. Now, uh, using this dot get function, uh, we are able to get this link. This is the my project ideas web page that we will be getting using this dot get function. After it, uh, if you want to find any element by name, and we have to simply uh, right like we uh, over here I have declared one more temporary variable and uh, find element by name this function will find the element by name and dot click function will simply click on that element and dot send keys function will send some uh, we can say the string or something like that in that element now this uh, dot save screenshot function will save the screenshot of the current window in the png file format and after this uh, if you want to download that image then you have to simply write uh, open that and dot show it will simply download as well and finally at last we'll be closing the browser using this dot close function now let me show you how exactly it will work like so for it i am executing step by step commands so first one is this this is my command prompt i have imported now as you can see over here this the chrome is open using our code chrome is being controlled by an automated test software that is selenium in our case now next thing is maximize using this function So over here you can see as I have pressed it this browser window is maximized. Now the next thing is if I want to get this uh, if I want to land in this web page that is myprojectideas.com web page I will simply use this command and this is a Chrome browser as you can see over here this is myprojectideas.com it has opened now 
uh, if you want to search an element by name so for example in this channel uh, you can see over here this one is a search bar so when you will click right click on it and then simply click on inspect then somewhere over here you will be able to see that the name is s right so i have simply written s over here because of its name that you will be able to see from the inspect element now i will click it and send the see that is python Now over here you can see this is our browser. Over here you can see nothing is there. Uh, let me click over here. Now uh, no arrow or something else, else is there. Now I am pasting those commands as you can see over here. My cursor was over here and uh, this element. Inside this element this python is now typed. Now let's execute one more function that is to take screenshot. Sure. Now over here I'm pasting the other commands. It's being processing. Yes, and you can see over here this the screenshot is taken. Now the last one is to close the browser. So I am over here finally pasting it. And you can see the browser is closed. So in this way you can automate using Selenium. You have to just write the codes over here and it will be executed in your Chrome browser. So in this way it will work. Thank you.